What's going on, my Yugi dudes? We've got some Heart of the Mystery Packs. It's Joey Wheeler, our overwhelming underdog. Ah, yeah! Hey, how about a little respect? What is happening, my Yugi dudes? All right, we are back at it again with some Heart of the Pack Mystery Packs, or as you heard at the beginning of the video, Heart of the Mystery Packs pen pending. Uh, I'm a make sure that uh, I get full rights to that before uh, Heart of the Pack decides to do it himself. <laughs> yeah, so he posted a video a while ago. Um, hey, shout out to Robert, AKA Toon World 666. This is his collection, guys, not mine. Uh, he's going through a little bit of a financial situation and I'm gonna try to help him out. And the best way that I thought about this is selling his collection to you guys through Mystery Packs. About his dude, Toon World 666, uh, going through some financial situation. The guy wants to sell his collection, so who better than uh, Heart of the Pack? You know, he has um, you know, a huge following, stuff like that. And uh, show my support as well for my love for uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! I decided to get in on this and uh, look forward to pulling some greatness. Uh, if you haven't seen the video, go ahead and check it out. Make sure it's uh, posted up on here. Um, but there is a, definitely a lot of awesome pulls for, uh, from these mystery packs. So I am super excited. Of course, give this video a big old thumbs up. Let me know that you like it. Make sure you're a public subscriber. Hit that little notification bell for max notifications when my videos do come out. And of course, leave a comment and give a big old shout out to Heart of the Pack and my guy over Toon World 666 and show him some love. All right, let's go ahead and get these things opened up. See what, oh man, I don't know why these things are so difficult. Let's see what greatness we can pull from here the first pack make sure that y'all can see it okay so we got the nice okay the appliancer uh copy vocal law of the cosmos psychic founder nice mecha phantom beast olean olion sorry uh sun god unification appliancer silo celtopus uh, psychic bounder uh ooh secret rare number c1 numeros Numeron case gate, Sunya, uh, specimen inspection, and that's it for the first pack. So, some pretty awesome pulls, I will say myself. Moving on to the next pack. Um, yeah, uh, they're supposed, you know, if you check out that video, uh, and if you haven't already uh, gotten in on this, um, there's definitely some awesome uh, chase cards uh, with this. So, Definitely decided to throw down with this stuff. We got the Downer Magician. Okay, nice. I think I have that one from Brothers of Legend. The Summon Storm. Virtual World Heme Nanyan from uh, the 21 Tins. And Pendulum Paradox from, oh, okay, from the uh, Mega Tins 2018. Let's go. Like his other packs uh, that I've done before, um, he'll usually put a chase card in a sleeve of some sort, so. If we feel sleeve, that means we got something big that's gonna be around. So let's see. Ooh, Assault Blackwing, Soya of the Rainstorm. Okay, Battle Legend, Armageddon, Mechlord Army, Galaxy Worm, Millennium Revelation, High Raid Draw, Secret Rare. Okay. I haven't pulled a lot of uh, Battles of Legend uh, Armageddon, so. And then uh, Fossil Dragon, Skull Geos. Also from Battles of Legend, Armageddon. Let's go. On to the next pack. We got some Fairy Tale Tales. Uh, Starry Night Blast, Heratic Dragon, King of Adam. Uh, Time Thief Redoer, goes from the past, nice. The Monarchs Erupt. Uh, Laval Archer, uh, Lovely Labyrinth of the Silver Castle. Okay, let's go. Nice. Uh, Time Thief Adjuster. And yo, let's go, Aluber, the Jester of Despia. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so it looks like we got something that's been sleeved up. So hopefully uh, something pretty epic. Can only imagine that it will be, because that's what Heart of the Pack does, is he delivers epic cards. So let's see what we got. Dynamorphia Dilpos, Submarine Touride. Ghost Trick War Wolf, uh, Galaxy Dragon, and the sleeve card is, yo, let's go, DB1 Ultra Rare, 
Jinzo. Oh, it's a side sleeve. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's go. I cannot get enough Jinzo in my life. But, man, DB pack one Jinzo. Oh, man, that's pretty epic. I don't think, I don't own anything DB pack, but definitely love a good Jinzo card. So, I first, for a second, I thought it was uh, Pharaoh's Servant, but obviously not. Not with the ultra rare, but dude, let's freaking go. This is an epic card. All right, moving on to the next pack. Uh, Heroic Sun Dragon, Overlord, Heliopolis, two of them, uh, Metal Foes Fusion, uh, Mass Change, I've got some ghosts from the past, Fairy Tale Tales, Time Thief, Winder, Dimensional Prism from RYMP. Oh man, I'm blanking on what that set is. And then Excavator Chevalier First Edition. Okay, let's go. Uh, SDWS. Oh man, I'm blanking on what that set, that set is, but either way, this is definitely an older card. Dude, let's freaking go. Appreciate it, my dude. Okay, on to the next pack, and it looks like we got another sleeve card. Okay, so uh, SDWS, so it's Warrior Strike. It's a structure deck, so I now know that. And then the um, RYMP was a raw yellow uh, mega pack. So uh, definitely some awesome, uh, awesome stuff. Let's see. We got Win the Wind Charmer Vedrit from ooh, Mystery Pack or Mega Pack 20, the 2010, the 2020s. Let's see. Nightmare Incarnate Idly and ooh, Strength and Unity. Ooh, I thought that was a, all right. Ooh, I don't have that card, but that's awesome with the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Let's freaking go. And we got, yo, Black Illusion Ritual. And it is MRL. Let's go. That is what I am talking about. That is an awesome looking card. I do have one of these already, but it's definitely not the MRL version. So, part of the pack, you the true MVP. I appreciate that, my dude. Let's freaking, I really like these side sleeves though. These side sleeves are actually really cool, so. Definitely awesome for uh, hooking up with the sleeve as well. Next pack, let's freaking go. Legendary Collection, Kaiba, Doom, uh, Doom Virus uh, Dragon, the Force Raider, classic 1900 four star, Parrot Dragon, um, Pegasus Classic, Protector with Eyes of Blue, Ultra Polymerization, Albion the Shrouded Dragon, uh, Lullaby of Obedience, okay, with the, the Seeker Rare, let's go. And then Ancient Rules, oh, okay, I think we got three Seeker Rares in this pack. And we got Dragon Master Knight, let's go with the Black Luster Soldier, perched on top of the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Let's freaking go. Ooh, okay, so we got a, like, white sleeve. So we don't have a penny sleeve on this one, we got a different sleeve. So let's see what we get. We got the top share. Uh, Ogdoatic Serpent Strike. Ice Jade Erosion. Mad Hacker. End of the line. Let's go. Branded Disciple. Uh, Noru Ares of the Vernal Dragon. Okay. We got uh, Oni Bimaru, Soul Sweeper. And we got. Yo! Let's go! Horus the Black Flame Dragon, level 6. In the ultimate rare, let's freaking go. This is from Soul of the Duelist. I cannot believe that we got an ultimate rare from one of these packs. Definitely not something I expected. Out of here. All right. So it's ooh, it's double sleeved. Okay, and it's still on the side sleeve. Pretty sweet. I like that. Try to get this thing out without. I'm just, oh man, my hands are kind of like shaking a little bit because. It is an ultimate rare, and for those that don't know, this is my favorite rarity of them all. Let's freaking go. Horus the Black Flame Dragon, level 6, ultimate rare, Soul of the Duelist. Let's freaking go. At this point, oh man, I think it's going to be, I think it's going to be pretty tough to uh, top an ultimate rare from uh, Soul of the Duelist. I don't, I don't know what else. Could be in these packs. Ooh, so Seal of Ori Calculus. Ori Calcos. Oh man, I don't know why I'm uh, struggling with that one. Some Raw's Disciple. But yeah, if 
If there's anything greater than that, I would just be blown away. Powered Crawler. Let's freaking go. Secret Rare. And Glacial Beast, Polar Penguin. More greatness from Battles of Legend. Armageddon. Let's freaking go. And, uh, you know, for the channel, as, as some of you may have noticed, I don't know if you noticed it or not, but I've gotten, uh, well, except for within the, like, the last week, <laughs> I've been uh, better about getting videos posted uh, more frequently, uh, not waiting as long um, to, to get videos out there, uh, giving you all some awesome content, seeing what greatness we can pull. We got the Armed Dragon, or Dark Armed, the Dragon of Annihilation. Let's freaking go. Oh, man. That thing looks amazing. And then Numeron Calling. Oh, man. You know, I love Secret Rares, too. Secret Rares, Ghost Rares, Ultimate Rares. I just can't get enough of these cards, so let's freaking go. Yeah, so trying to get more frequent with uh, video posting for you all. You know, continue to del deliver content and, uh, you know, not not wait, you know, only once a week or something like that, you know, because one, I, I enjoy doing this stuff. Uh, but also I'm trying to give y'all, you know, some greatness as well with all these videos. Uh, we got another sleeved one, so let's see what we got. Dinomorphia alert and acid trap hole from DDS. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? Let's freaking go. I cannot believe a DDS acid trap hole. Yeah, it's not the blue eyes, Exodia, or um, um, Dark Magician, but still, to to have a DDS card, like, I actually have Salamandra's DDS uh, in my binder that I got a long time ago from a friend that decided they didn't want to play anymore, and they gave away all their cards, so that was one of the cards that they gave me, so now I have two of the six DDS cards, and, uh, man, I'm blanking on what that third one was, but it looks like I like a fan. I, I can't recall off the top of my head, but yeah, two of six DDS cards. All right, almost there. So some corrections and retractions. So it's it wasn't so it wasn't what I was thinking of for the DDS cards. Uh, the sixth card that I didn't remember off the top of my head is Seriaru, which I have right there. But that's from Ghost from the Past. It is not from DDS, but that would be pretty awesome if I did have it. Um, so, but still, two of six. I do have Salamandra. That was uh, not a retraction. Uh, we got another sleeve card. So, let's see what greatness we can pull next. Okay. Uh, we got Ghost Trick or Tree. And, yo, Polymerization from L.O.B. My goodness. Let's freaking go. Getting some classic cards from this. Open packs. From my dude, heart of the pack. And yeah, this is definitely, uh, yep, 100%, definitely from uh, the original LOB print. Obviously, not first edition. And unfortunately, not a wavy print, but that's okay. I don't need a wavy print. I still got polymerization, and that's pretty epic. All right, a few more packs left, but what do you know? We have another sleeved pack. Let's freaking go. I can't, I can't. At this point, I don't even know what to expect anymore from these things because there's such greatness in here. So, le okay, one more. Let's see what we got this time. And reinforcement of the army from uh, Legacy of Darkness. Okay, let's freaking go. Another classic card, LOD. Definitely can't find a reprint of this uh, anymore. So, yeah, I can't one of these as a old, or I'm um, sorry, super rare. Just super excited feels like an ultra rare but uh anything from back then uh and it's called a magic card let's freaking go <laughs> that's what i'm talking about okay got some emergency teleport metal foes fusion the gear town cosmojo goes from the past greatness galaxy ice cypher blade dragon metal foes silver dragoonity draft and dra uh, heretic dragon of tefnut and yo, Flying Elephant, okay, let's go. Battles of Legend, Relentless Revenge, Greatness, let's freaking go. Woo wee, we got a, oh my goodness, the whole thing is sleeved. What the hell, okay, so everything is sleeved in this pack. Let's freaking go, okay, so we got some Duelist Saga in here. Uh, Vampire, Retainer, um, oh, 
This is um, Hidden Arsenal uh, Collection 1, Dragoonity Phalanx. Uh, Duelist Overload, Swamp Frog. Okay, oh, that's a pretty awesome card. Let's go. Uh, Yadagarasu from DB2. Okay, nice. Uh, Mech Knight, Blue, uh, Blue Sky from... Um, oh, man, what is... EXF... Um, oh, man, I'm blanking on it right now. That's hurting my soul. That's awesome. Junk Synchron. Okay, let's go. Uh, yo, Blue Eyes, White Dragon from Legendary Collection 1. Let's freaking go. Okay. Oh, man, we got a Collector's Rare. Obviously, I can't read that off the top of my head, and I'm unsure what that one is, but golly, that's awesome. Make sure it's posted on the screen since uh, I can't recall off the top of my head. And then the Fiend Mega Cyber from Pharaoh Servant. Let's freaking go. I think I have one of these, but I pulled it from a um, one of the 2010 to 17 reprint. This is definitely not that reprint. This is definitely uh, the original, original unlimited reprint. So if that makes sense for, for y'all, you know, I'm, I'm more than certain that y'all can uh, make sense of that. But let's go, Fiend Mega Cyber. All right, let's go. All right, so that one was uh, Rajin the Break Bolt Star, but obviously I already posted up in the corner uh, when, when I showed the card. But uh, yeah, Rajin the Break Bolt Star. Let's freaking go. Collector's Rare, Japanese. Uh, let's see, Dark Horizon, okay, from uh, MVP1. That was the movie pack. Uh, from Dark uh, Dark Side or um, Dark Side Dimension, so that was definitely that was definitely a pretty neat set. I do have a box of that myself, first edition. Uh, I think it's a secret rare box, um, regular box, but I, I'm holding on to it for a special day. Guy of the Fierce Knight Origin, Witchcrafter, and Madame Vare, Sun God Unification, uh, Rosebud. Okay, let's go. Ooh, from Premium Pack to Let's Go. Definitely an older set. And then Neo Kaiser Glider. Wow, look at that from uh, the 2019 tins. That is a pretty awesome looking card. Let's freaking go. All right, we are on to the last pack. And like part of the pack likes to do last pack magic, last pack tragic. But what I can tell you right now, right off the bat, we got some last pack magic because we have a seal a sleeve card so we are definitely ending with some extra greatness for this video let's freaking go if you haven't already hit that like button let's see what we got to end this thing some emergency teleport and 1609 yeah oh bazoo oh it's a double okay we got bazoo the soul eater from labyrinth of nightmare let's go Man, we got a double sleeve. Last pack magic, absolutely. And we got Solemn Judgment from Metal Raiders. Let's, fr oh my goodness, he put both of these in the last pack. Well, at least the last pack for uh, for this opening. But man, he put both of these in there. Let's freaking go. Bazoo, the Soul Eater. Man, I, everyone used to play this thing when I was... Uh, when it uh, first came out. This was definitely uh, one of those staple cards, obviously with Solemn Judgment as well, but damn, hard the pack, above and beyond once again. Whew, man, we definitely pulled some amazing cards here today. Epic is 100% understatement. Uh, and, you know, I, I put them out there, you know, as I was pulling them, you know, leaving them out for display throughout the video. And uh, as you can see, definitely a whole lot of greatness. And coming from my dude, Heart of the Pack, who is definitely doing some greatness with helping out Toons, uh, Toon World 666, uh, trying to help him uh, get his financial situation back in order, and uh, definitely a great thing that he's doing. With that being said, I hope you all enjoy the rest of your day, wherever you may be, and I will catch you all later. Out. Ultimate rare for Vintage Droplet.
We'll, we'll, we'll chat after this. Let's go, Tucker! The end! Yo! Right at the end! Last yo, pack. yo, yo, yo! Last what? Pack. Okay, well, well, let me look at these. Let me look at these.